out there. Here comes a runner to the play, and they get him. So Dubzinski runs right into an out, and they throw the runner out at the play. The field hit well. This ball is gone. Home run, Tito Landrum. Ripped by Edgar Martinez to left. Carlos Lee will watch this one go! It's gone! And the Mariners have the lead! He is at it again in the postseason. His fifth postseason home run, and John Olerud sends it back, 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 gone! The Seattle Mariners dodge bullets. The White Sox could have won it in the bottom of the ninth. Drag butt. Popped up. Guzman retreats to the outfield. Game one for the Twins. Bounce to short. Out at second. Relay to first. Double play. Oh, a huge double play. If this doesn't give you goosebumps, you don't have goosebumps. To center field. Hunter drifting back. Room. Ball game over. And the Twins take the first two against Chicago. Looking to put this thing away against Sandy Alomar Jr. Breaks his bat, pops it up. Game will be over. Save number 38 for Godado. Twins complete the sweep. That's in the right field short. Timo coming on. He's got a good arm, but Torrey's got good speed. So here comes Torrey. He's going to give it a shot. And here's the throw. Oh, my gosh. He just leveled Jamie Burke, who did not have the ball. Well, if Jamie wasn't blocking the plate, this is a cheap shot. That's, that's what I'm that. saying. I want to see where Jamie is setting up. That's all right. Okay, that's where you foul one right there. That's how things get started right there. Burke headed to the hospital after this. Hunter said, I wasn't trying to hurt him. Now everybody thinks I'm the bad guy. I'm the good guy. I was just trying to make a play. Perez has been great lately. Jock Jones, top of the 10th. Jose Valentin had a tough day. 0 for 3, caught stealing. And this error with two outs in the 10th. His pitcher, Shingo Takatsu, can't believe it. Two pitches later, it costs them, of course. Jones, the base hit. Chris John Guzman would score. Twins lead 5-4. Shingo Takatsu facing Casey Blake. Blake going deep. His first Indians down two, and Mr. Zero was less than zero because he gave up more than zero. Two batters later, Takatsu facing Coco Crisp. Tribe down one. Next batter, Ronnie Belliard. A swing and a long drive. Deep left field. Away back. And gone. Ronnie Belliard ties it in the ninth. How about that? Three solo home runs by the Tribe. And oh, is payback sweet. Fall off the map. Angel Barroa with the Royals down 9-8 to eight and 2 on. A base hit off Dustin Hermes. And Emil Brown comes in to score, but when Jermaine Dye bobbles it, Mark Tian comes roaring around to score. The Royals, who had lost 104 games in a row when they trailed after eight. Top eight, two on for Aaron Boone. He homered earlier. Singles on the 0-2 pitch from Bobby Jenks. Hafner scores. Game tied. Martinez scores. Indians lead. A swing and a high pop. Second baseman calling. He makes the catch. Ball game. And the Cleveland Indians creep a little bit closer. Garland trying to throw strikes, making him swing. Bye. You know what? He's hot. You're right. Bye-bye, baby. Bye-bye. He had two home runs in this game. That's 29. He would get 30. He's also got 100 RBI now. And the Tribe has gone into Chicago and taken two out of three. Bottom nine. Bases loaded. One out. Similar to the top half of the frame. Jermaine Dye popping it up to Michael Kadire in shallow right. And once again, the runner on third cannot advance. Two outs. White Sox fail as well. Next batter, Juan Arebe. We had the bases loaded, and we should have won the game right there. That's what Ozzy Guillen said afterwards. Bottom 10, Jesse Crane induces Tadahito Aguchi to ground into the 5-3 double play. After a big hustle play on what looked like a bloop single, and Lee Croy is going to bring him home because Ford is wearing his PF Flyers. The Twins take a 2-1 lead. 
Off Bobby Jenks, next batter, Jones doubles to deep center. Two more score. The Twins win it 4-1. The White Sox have lost 10 of their last 14. Cubs trying to end it. The White Sox trying to get this one into the tent. Deep to center field. Anderson's back. Warning track. Ball game over. Cubs win. Ramirez in the center. They win it 4-3. His second home run of the day. Bouncer. Third down the line. Gomez to third. Rounding third. He's going to tie the game. And Span heads to third. The comeback is complete. The 0-2 pitch. Ball rip. Fair. And the game is tied. Ball rolls into the corner. Thames is going to get held at third. Granderson at second. And we are tied. Ball hit up the middle. It's past the mirrors into center. Here comes Cleet Thomas. The throw by Wise is not in time. The Tigers, one in the ninth to tie it, one in the tenth to win it. Sharply hit, base hit. Hudson around third, he's going to score. And Kubel gets his third hit, and the tying runs at first for Michael Kadair. Lace to right center field. Mauer's going to score. Great job by Rios cutting that ball off. Kubel to third base. Fly ball, short right center field. That's trouble. Down for a hit. Kanaya will be held. The Twins have tied it up in the ninth. The Watch throw the going nowhere. And Kanaya's going to score the winning run. Deep to right. And there it goes. Oh, my, oh, my. <laughs> Jim Tony. <laughs> the first walk-off hit at Target Field in dramatic fashion. It has to be middle of the plate and mask high on the catcher. That's gone. Hangs one, and that one is, in fact, gone! Oh, my! Gone. See ya. Game over. Wow. Oh my goodness. First pitch, Miguel Cabrera, game winning walk off home run of all the unlikely comebacks. Grounded off of his glove into shallow right field. That'll get two to the plate. And the tying run comes to the plate. In comes the pitch. And a drive into right center field in the alley. And it's. Gonna drop near the warning track. Hosmer to second. Kane coming home. It is a one run game. Pitch is made. And a drive into left center field in the alley. And the Royals have tied this game. Gutierrez on his way to second base with a double. This is just crazy. Wow. Grounder up the middle, base hit. Astros lead 5-4. to four. Jordan comes up big time. From Kimbrell to Correa. Line to right. Garcia turns around and can't find it. Two runs are going to score on an opposite field double from Correa. Breaking pitch. Rip to left field. Good one. Good night. Two runs shot by Kyle Tucker. And the one-two. Swinging a drive toward right center. Back goes Robert. Back near the stands. That ball is gone. A game-winning home run for Chris Morrell. Can you believe it? Listen to this crowd. Come Sox Series, you just never know.